It's all about helping yourself in a manner of speaking. Pick and Pay is giving its customers the chance to test their new self-service till points. So we're always looking out for new ways to help customers, uh, to help make their shopping more convenient, to help them uh, uh, get, through the, get through the store more quickly. And this is an idea that uh, is quite popular in, in some countries and we thought we'd, we'd trial it here with, uh, with our customers. The pilot test of the new terminals will run for six months. The retailer will then decide whether to roll out the tolls nationwide. First-time customers have expressed mixed reactions on social media. But the retailer's greatest resistance is coming from employee trade unions. Kosatu and its affiliates say they have not been consulted by the retailer. They say employees are fearful the new machines will impact jobs. These automated tellers are going to lead to job losses and Kusato is going to oppose it. If need be, we'll call for boycotts of those retail stores that insist on putting in place measures that are anti-worker and anti the national objectives of South Africa. But Pick and Pay says employees will not be adversely affected. Well, I think we can reassure everyone that actually there are no job losses as a result of, uh, as a result of this pilot. It's all about trying to find extra ways of helping customers. It's all about actually, as you can see, there are more staff in the shop rather than fewer staff um, as, a result of the, uh, as a result of the pilot. Self-service toll points are all about convenient shopping. But the burning question remains, at what cost? RT Nazi, Cape Town.